The MiG-41, also known as the PAC-DP or Prospective Aviation Complex for Long Range Interception, is Russia's next generation interceptor, and by 2025, it stands as one of the most ambitious projects in modern military aviation. Designed to replace the legendary MiG-31 Foxhound, the MiG-41 is being developed by Mikoyan under the United Aircraft Corporation, with a focus on speed, stealth, and advanced weapons capabilities for defending Russian airspace across vast northern and polar regions. The MiG-41 is reportedly capable of reaching speeds exceeding Mach 4.5 far beyond what current generation fighters can achieve. This puts it in the hypersonic category, giving it the ability to intercept high-speed threats like hypersonic missiles, strategic bombers, and surveillance drones. Its projected operational ceiling is around 35,000 meters, allowing it to fly near space altitudes an ideal feature for strategic deterrence and early interception. In terms of design, the MiG-41 is rumored to incorporate stealth features, a sleek aerodynamic profile, and next-generation composite materials for reduced radar cross-section and better survivability. Although no official images have been released by 2025, conceptual renderings suggest a futuristic appearance with a long fuselage, sharp angles, and an internal weapons base similar to what we see in 5th or 6th generation jets. Performance-wise, the MiG-41 is expected to use advanced turbojet or ramjet propulsion, possibly even incorporating scramjet technology in the future. While the details remain classified, sources hint at the ability to launch anti-satellite missiles, long-range air-to-air missiles, and possibly even directed energy weapons. It may also be equipped with AI-assisted avionics, sensor fusion, and autonomous capabilities. The MiG-41 is intended to complement Russia's Su-57 stealth fighters, not compete with them. While the Su-57 is a multi-role fifth-generation aircraft, the MiG-41 is a pure interceptor, built to cover thousands of kilometers quickly and deal with fast, high-altitude threats. It will likely operate alongside ground-based radar systems and early warning aircraft to form a layered defense network. One of the standout claims about the MiG-41 is its potential to become optionally manned or even fully unmanned in the future. This would mark a major step toward autonomous air superiority platforms, especially useful for high-risk reconnaissance or deep space surveillance missions. However, it's important to note that the MiG-41, as of 2025, has not yet entered full-scale production. Russia has hinted at a first flight possibly happening before the end of the decade, with development well underway in simulation and prototyping phases. The project is part of Russia's strategic push to dominate the skies with hypersonic speed and long-range interception, countering threats from NATO, the United States, and potentially China in the years ahead. In summary, the MiG-41 is not just an evolution of the MiG-31. It is a revolution in air interception. With extreme speed, stealth, and futuristic capabilities, it represents the next frontier of aerial warfare. If Russia successfully brings this aircraft into service, it could redefine the role of interceptors in 21st century 